Welcome to our Cinex Tools Overview. This is the first edition of a multi-part tutorial series. Cinex Tools is a standalone media file and deliverables management utility application made up of several modules. Really, you should consider these tools as companions to your nonlinear editor. The primary module is Cinex Insert. This provides the ability to overwrite video, audio, and close caption data into existing flat files. For those with a longer history in media production, the insert process is almost identical to inserting into a videotape. Timecode is used to define the source and target areas. And it's strange to use this description in a world of nonlinear editing, but the process is destructive, meaning the inserts are not adding to a package, they are true overwrites where the original data is replaced by new data. Currently, CineX is Mac OS X only, but the Windows version is now in beta and will release soon. We're going to get things rolling with a short animation that provides sort of a 30,000 foot level overview of file-based insert editing. Nonlinear editing, the unshackling of editors from the restraints of linear tape, is nothing short of a miracle. But the requirement that entire shows be re-rendered and or re-exported to accomplish even a simple change, like correcting a misspelled title, is a maddening waste of time and money. Cinedec solved this by developing the ability to directly change video, audio, and closed captions in flat files using Cinedec recorders. Cinedec's true file-based insert editing is in use by a diverse set of production companies and already delivering hundreds of hours of programming. Now there is Cinex Insert, Cinedec's standalone software application for changing content in your closed files. Using a familiar player-recorder interface, the process is simple. To change a misspelled title, open the destination file with the incorrect title in the recorder window. Set in and out points around the section to be changed. Turn on the destination tracks. In this case, just the video needs to be overwritten. Open a source file with the corrected title and video in the player window. Set an endpoint and go. That's it. The application writes the corrected source content directly into the target file. And because it's all happening between files, the insert is far faster than real time. Actual speed all depends on your specific hardware, but basically, Inserts happen as fast as your system can read and write the selected source content. Regardless of origin, CineX Insert provides direct edit access to your ProRes, DNX HD and HR, AVC Intra, JPEG 2000, and XDCAM HD master files. Moreover, resolution does not matter. SD, HD, and 4K are all supported. CineX Insert is all about efficiency. Multiple slate versions, spelling corrections, embargoed shot replacements. With CineX Insert, they are now all easy, taking just minutes instead of hours. To follow up a bit more on the origins of CineX tools, the insert editing capability was designed into the Cinedec recorders in 2014, building onto their ability to do digital cuts, or print to file, from nonlinear editors. With a Cinedec, you can create flat file masters of your timeline using virtually any codec, including the most common deliverable formats. With a Cinedec and insert edit, you can make changes directly into many of those deliverable files. You can also make changes to files exported from other systems. This eliminates the need to re-export an entire show just to accomplish a simple change. 
So basically, Cinex Tools takes the multi-format, resolution-independent insert engine from the Cinedec recorders and places it under a standalone user interface. There are some significant advantages to using Insert Edit on the Cinedec hardware platforms. But one of the advantages of the standalone Cinex application is that most of the processes are file-based asymmetric reads and writes, so they generally happen at speeds far faster than real-time. This also means most recent computers can run Cinex. It doesn't need to be the latest, most powerful system. But disk I.O. is important, so writing files to an SSD or through an 8 gig or faster network to high performance central storage will provide the best performance. That's it for the overview. Next up is a tour of the Cinex Tools application.